Jesus. Thanks, dude. Okay, so yeah, this is all I get, just this and that. That's all I get before booting the game. Just turning the headset volume off a bit. Let's get cracking. Isaac Clark, engineering and ship system specialist. Computer specialist, security officer and security protocol. Isaac, it's me. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. Oh, I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. Such a little thing. That's her? Nicole? Yeah. First deferred from her in weeks. We're five minutes out, you still got that thing on repeat? Guess you really miss her. Fishermer is not a job you turn down, but six months apart with only vid calls? It's rough. Easy to say mm. the wrong thing. I don't blame you. I'd listen to my girlfriend over Hammond reciting security protocols. Forewarned is forearmed, Miss Daniels. So you keep saying. Here we go. Nice clean reaction. This looks like freaking hyperspace. Speed with you. You just said. Uh, imagine six months staring at that chunk of rock. Ooh. To an independent miner, that's paradise. Aegis 7 is one of the richest finds in CEC history. Some prospecting team set up for life. Now, where is she? There. Confirming visual contact with USG Ishimura. Mm. What a beauty. Biggest planet cracker in her class, you know. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it so dark? We should be able to see her running lights. Yes. Yeah. I'll get us into hailing range. Someone's got to be waiting up for us. Just be careful on the approach. I'm not taking any chances with the CEC's pride and joy. No chances, huh? Is that why you were digging into my personnel files before we left? You track your file access? I'm a computer analyst. It comes with a job. <laughs> <laughs> I read standard CEC background checks, Miss Daniels. If you want to work in the big leagues, you have to play ball. <clears throat> Sir, we're in ailing range. See, obviously, I'm on the USG easiest Ishimura. difficulty, this is so. The emergency maintenance team of the USG makes sense. Responding to your distress I don't know anything about Coming this. Ishimura. Ishimura, do you copy? Come in. This is a USG Kelly. You ever hear of a full communications black on one of these things? No. Come on, someone pick up the damn phone. The hell is that? Uh, sounds like their communication array is busted. Maybe a broken encoder. Daniels and I can handle it in 48 hours, max. Hey, that gives you plenty of time to catch up with Nicole. Yeah, hmm. I hope so. Jen, Johnson, take us in. Gravity tether's engaged. Automated docking. Whoa. Here's a go. I'm losing control. Fuck. We're off course. Daniel. Guidance system override isn't responsive. Shit. Shit. We're coming in too hot. He's just gonna smash us into the hall. Jen, aim for that emergency stabilizer. There. The blue light. It might slow us down. Guys, drop the flash shield. Everyone brace yourself. <laughs> Call him the stabilizer, Isaac. That I always read the manual. What the fuck's going on with flight control? That guidance system's a death trap. Better add it to your repair list. Jen, what's our damage? Compter down. We lost poor booster. We've got a fire in one of the stabilizers and singularity core's a mess. It could be worse, but not by much. 
Then let's get some help. Johnston, stay with the Kellyan. We'll send a medic. Everyone else, with me. Woo! Pop that helmet on. Alright, I'm actually walking around now. Okay, cool. Okay, that's that. And I go over here. So I can't go there, I have to go this way. Hello? Well, there's a security team. Shit must have heard that landing. Be proud, Chen. You gotta see her in one piece. Johnson might disagree. But you're off to buy the first round tonight. I would have That lighting looks gorgeous. You see anyone in flight control? No, nobody. We didn't take out the sign. She murdered. It holds the record for the highest number of planet crashes, with 34 today and highest dead weight. May as well get signed. Security in. chicken. Please collect all belongings. Unauthorized. Unauthorized articles will be confiscated. Alright, hello. Welcome, Isaac Clark, to the USG Ishimura. Thanks. Rig synced. Collect kinesis and stasis modules from Acting Chief Engineer Jacob Temple. Location? Error. Employee not found. I can't read security. Same for the Chief Engineer. What is wrong with their comms? Ooh. Unlocked. What is that? Credits. Let's have a little look around. Connection lost. No shit. Locked. Someone left in a hurry. Welcome aboard. Move. Move Where's dude. the security detail? Where's anything? Welcome aboard. There's nothing wrong. Co no Concordance no Extraction Corporation. For God's sake. Oh. That security console still works. Oh, Isaac God, that's damage. a lot of reading. Disclaimer this article is sponsored by CEC, Print and Publishing Division, and may not represent the views and amazing. Of Amazing Universe magazine. Smell that? Smell what? Like something died in the air vents. It oh. is a lot of reading for the first fucking thing. Fuck, I'll give it a go though. <clears throat> Imagine a world where basic resources like fuel or metals and eyes are hard to come by. If I can figure Shut out the fuck down. up, I'm reading. Imagine if humanity's needs were entirely dependent on the I nearly extinct resources of console. Earth and the dwindling supplies of the colonies. Older readers don't need to imagine such a world. You lived it less than a century ago. Looking to the stars for additional resources was nothing new, but at the time the only shock point capable ships were smaller vessels that could barely keep up with demand. Enter the Ishimura, named after the celebrated astroph astrophysicist and inventor of the shock point drive, Hideki Ishimura. The USG Ishimura was the first of... Shut the fuck up! <laughs> um, where was I? Was the first of the massive planet cracker ships built in 2446. She has enjoyed a long and storied career. The Ishimura was first was the first vessel of so I utilized a shock point drive for large scale commercial deep space expeditions. At her inception, the Ishimura was hailed as the savior of the colonies. She was created to mine and process asteroids and even small moons with remarkable efficiency. She was also the first ship capable of the pioneering scan and catch technique for harvesting mineral-rich asteroids. Utilizing huge gravity tethers, the Ishimura could lock onto asteroids and pull them inside the ship's massive collection base for quick and efficient smelting. At 62 years old, the Ishimura is still in remarkable shape. Her equipment has been upgraded over the years and many of her interior spaces have been retrofitted to take advantage of current technology advances. Uh, despite the many long years of service, she remains the 
pride of the CEC fleet and is still Company's largest planet cracker. Whenever a vital, whenever a vital deep space mining project requires skill, experience, and dedication, the Ishimura is ready to answer the call. It is ships like the Ishimura and the dedication of the men and women who crew her that build the CEC into the trusted, dependable resource provider it is today. All right, there we go. Sorry, I was reading a data thing. Doing it, I was busy expositioning. Uh. Oh god, that smell. What have you got, Isaac? Shit. It's not just comms or the guidance system. Half the Ishimura's in the red. Engines, hull, the tramps. You could do that kind of damage to a planet cracker. <laughs> Up. Power to the elevator. <coughs> nope. Detected. Quarantine activated. Another malfunction? Uh. No. The quarantine systems are all fine. Oh, wait. Do you hear that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I hear it. Yeah, man. Uh. What's going on? There's something in here with us. Up there! Woo! Woo! What is that? Whoa! Oh, what the fuck is that? Ooh! Uh, uh, what? Am I running? Which way? I don't know which way I'm running. Oh, this way. Weird creatures, creatures and things. Can't see. Is this where I need to be? Oh. Ooh. That type of death harkens back to a couple of horror games. Um, Outlast with the Doctor Dude and Evil Within with Spider Bitch. What is this? Uh, okay. Plasma Cutter. Cool. Cut off their limbs. Aim, hold, primary fire, LT hold, B to rotate projectiles, reload. So. Okay. I used a couple of shots, but. Alright. RB to punch. And. Foot stomp. Sweet. And I got some credits, nice. So I got a weapon, so that's cool. Am I supposed to fire into that? What are those things? They have weird. Are those. Were those on their back or was that their actual arms? Extra arms? <laughs> I don't like them. <laughs> I don't like them at all. Yes, please, open that. Ooh. Security request retrieved. Nope, wrong button. We shot that fucker right between the eyes and it didn't die. Smith had to shoot its fucking arms and legs off. For God's sake, send help. Okay. 
small med pack. Um, that's inventory in BD's health pack. I feel like at some point I will have to go back and review the controls. Oh, oh hi. God, Isaac. You made it. Just. They're everywhere. Shit, is he, uh... He's gone. Nothing I can do. What the fuck are these things? The ones I saw? Some of them were wearing Ishimura uniforms. They're the crew? How the hell can they be the crew? Look at them. We need to get to the bridge. There's a thousand people on board. Someone will be there. We can't. The tram system's wrecked. Everything's locked down because of the quarantine. And you're both repair techs. So how do we do this? I don't know. There's a broken tram car blocking the tunnel. It's gridlocked the system. And the data board's burned out. I can't lift the lockdown or call the tram until we get a spare from the maintenance bay. But it's all on Isaac's side of the quarantine. I'll handle it. Just make sure there's power to the repair systems. And Isaac? Yeah? I'm sure Nicole's okay. She's the doctor, right? She'll do the smart thing. Yeah. Yeah, she always does. Find somewhere safe. I'll be back soon. Interesting. Get the tram running. That's cool. So I got nodes. That thing. Place those trams. Nice. What is this? Okay, yeah, the data board's needed. So, uh, yeah, I just have to keep in my and I can punch and do the kicky thing. Data board is missing. The stomach sounds like a frickin' rhinoceros. Hear it a mile away. <laughs> oh, what was that? I just saw something. Oh no, it was just the chair. What's that? That's my energy. Cool. How much have I got? And I'm guessing someone reserve so that can be unlocked. More plasma energy, so thank you. Which way do I go? Tram tunnel. Bug baggage. Except baggage. I don't know which way is the right way. Whoa, that's cool. More, more ammo, nice. Preserve ammunition by dismembering enemies' limbs. Cut off limbs to kill enemies quickly. Dismember enemies to slow them down. Okay. But I'm on the easy difficulty, so most likely the ammo will be easy to come across. That was fun. <laughs> I think I got a little bit carried away. Ah, for the thing. Just no power here. So I'm not supposed to be here. What did I just do? Place the damage tram, okay, that, that brings up a thing. Holding, holding down um, right stick. So, yeah, I got a little bit carried away there, that was fun. Okay. Every body I see, I have to be sure now. What is 
that? Uh, oh, is that the other side? That was the other side of where I was, I think. Status module. LT and Y. Ooh. Limited time. No, but I found a stasis module. If I'm faster than I got it. Status pack. Uh, recharge the status module. Recharge stations by using the state or by the status packs in the inventory. And there's a save station. So this is like um, Alien Isolation because they had this. Was it the save points where you had to? hold the things in and it went for you have to wait for the green lights. Ah, then you can save. What was that? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> oh. yeah, anyway, as I was saying, yeah, it's like alien isolation save stations. That doesn't auto save or whatever. Are you alive? Okay. Getting a lot of ammo. So that's there was a recharge thing right there that I could have used. I don't know what these are. They look important, but then I could just walk into them. Isaac, don't bother shooting those fuckers in the head. Doesn't even slow them down. Okay. The only way is hacking them apart. Those arms, their legs. Does that even kill them? Or do they just start moving? Well, I... Retrieved. Benson to engineering. You got a stasis module handy? We need one in tram maintenance stat. The autoloader's fried. I got a damaged tram car on the tracks, and if the whole system's gridlocked, guess who they're calling? Temple here, sending a stasis module now. What happened to the autoloader? No idea. A lot of shit's been breaking down, and I keep hearing things. Down in the gears where, where no one could be. Yeah, I already know about you know? those things. I know. All disengaged. Prepare systems online. Loading system reinitialized. Warning. Autoloader malfunction. Please contact a repair technician. You know, that is satisfying. <laughs> Woo! Right, Dr. Claw, disengaged. 
Penny look moving that tram car? The autoloader's busted, but Stasis should do the trick. Just gotta time it. Great. But hurry. Okay? Sound carries down here. Well, I gotta time the things. Stasis time the. Okay. Right, loader claw engaged. Ah. one down. You said a data board was fried too? Inventory yeah. says there's a spare board in the maintenance bay. We can't run the trams without it. I guess this is the maintenance bay. Oh, that's the tram station. What was that? Oh, it was just... Ah! Oh, he was attached to me. Okay, I was like, what, what the fuck? So I can actually stasis them too. And stuff. To get better hits on them or something. That's the cargo bay. That was the bathrooms. But where is the frickin' medical bay? Or was that where I came from? I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna save again. <laughs> okay, so yeah, that's locked. That was the bathroom. That was that. I can't read. Find the data board. Is it still around here? Is there anything else around here? I need to do. Mid packs. Dangling bodies. Can I go in there? That so looks go in a ball. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else of value here. No. Okay, I guess I go back to where I was.
do hope they aren't one of those things that's triggered when you're triggered by sound because that would suck Have that before on yeah that I bet. Use the map screen to check important locations and objectives. Uh that isn't I was gonna say that isn't the map. There we go. Oh god, I have to use the D-pad to check. So that was the save station. I have to go all the way over there. God damn. Okay. It's still open. Can I do anything here now? Still just okay. Yeah. All right, nothing here. I have to check everything. <laughs> I have to be sure. Stomp, stomp, stomp. That's a locked door. I can't open that, can I? Uh, I don't know. Claims that's where I need to go, the path thing. That was locked, that door. Safe station. There was one here all this time, and I didn't know. What was it? This? Yeah, it's no, <coughs> no power. Oh, there we go. Uh, I'm dumb. Right here we go. On the safe station. <laughs> you got obliterated. Credits. Yeah. 
You have explosives seem to do the job. That's just a big loop. Those I just I keep thinking like I can go through those because it's just like ooh. The thing in there. Go somewhere in particular. Trying to follow the cables. Hmm. I don't know. The particular spot I'm supposed to be going to. So far, there's just been goodies to snatch up. that but I can't get in there yeah no power so I guess I need another circuit breaker or something if I get another I don't know anything I don't want to put it in that one now where's that door Must be a way to get a, a second one. So I can have both on at once. That has no power. So I have to find something else. No. Something up there. Get up there. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I can look at the map. Something about the left. I don't know. Hmm. 
Oh, that. Can't get there. There's a way for me to get down. Can't get over, can I? I see the left. Oh! Call me dumb. Da 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 dumb da dumb dumb dumb. Thought that was where the gap gap thing was. I'm slow, I'm slow, I know. One This is fine because all the lights are outside for alarm. <laughs> that should have power now. Hopefully. If not, me be mad. Fancy chick shit. Oh, hi. Oh my god, there's three come to join the party. Drop or sell items to make space in the inventory. Isaac, we can't stay here much longer. Hearing a lot of movement. Hold on. I sell. I got the data board. I'm coming back to tram control now. Daniel, get ready to go. Um, okay. To Ian Smith from J. Right subject, Poker Night. Keeping this off rig leg in case Benson's listening in. You in for Poker Night tonight, or are you going to let Caitlin keep walking around with your credits? To J. Right from M. Smith, subject regarding Poker Night. I'm in, but can you not invite Pavey this time? I know he still blames himself for Sorossi's accident and everything, but no one wants to hear about anyone's fucking nightmares. Especially that one where he saw Sarossi up and walking around with half his head missing. And don't give me shit about it, I'm serious, it's messing with me. Last night I had one of those dreams where you wake up, you know. When my dad was sitting right next to my bed, talking to me, felt so real I kept seeing him out. The corner of my old day. And trust me, that's one son of a bitch who needs to stay dead, Smith. But I need to need to drop something. Is that 
What store though? What store is there? I don't know what store it's referring to. Upgrade weapon and thing. Bring you have to improve the Let the weapons red capabilities by investing power nodes in there. Lock your upgrades, gain access to unique upgrades, expand the weapons upgrade graph, bringing upgrade parts to the bench. Upgrades can reset any time in exchange for credits. Interesting. Did that take up? Did that free space? <laughs> no. What shop is it referring to? I don't see a shop. Another node. Uh, oxygen. for that size all right now to get out of here I don't know what it's referring to a score. Oh, hi. Fighting in the dark. Something hit the roof, but it seems operational. Quarantine lockdown was lifted, so you can get to the hangar. Comms are still down, though, so be ready for anything. What's the plan? You and Johnson fix up the Kellyan. We report to the bridge. Standard emergency protocol. What? Protocol? Hammond, people are dying here. And I'm not losing anyone else. We stick to procedure. We'll get through this. <sighs> we'll see. Turn to the Kellyan. Which was this way. I think. Yes. Okay, 
hearing noises. He's just nasty. Gonna come back. Hammond from the grinding background request. Per, per your request, here's what we can find on these specialists that have sent from the repair. Oh, look, there's me, Isaac. Shut up. I was born to Paul and Octavia Clark on Earth in the eastern seaboard region of the American Republic. Paul Clark was an award winning ship architect employed by the Galactic, by the Galactic Union Merchant Marine Corp. His records show extended time off world away from his family. When Isaac was born, Paul, whatever, was given a temporary reassignment to Earth based Gump ship production facility. During the four year tour, Paul and Octavia raised Isaac together. When the tour was over, Paul shipped off to an extended off world tour. Jesus fucking hell. Influence on his son must have rubbed off. Records indicate Isaac pursued studies in mechanical and electrical engineering and achieved high honours. According to medical and psychiatric reports, Powell Clark's absence had profound effect on Octavia. She suffered from depression and personal anguish until doctors encouraged her to find fulfilment by working with charitable organisations. It is believed that this is how she ended up coming into contact with the Church of Unitology. Holy shit. That is way too much to read. Oh my god. At first her association with the church appeared to alleviate her mental condition. The cancellation of her therapy sessions correspond with the local parish announcements of her initiation ceremony. There are indications that she sold off much of the family's estate to finance all membership in the church and the soul cleanse. They are required to enter the higher ranks. Isaac appears to have been selected to a prominent engineering school but with some Surmise that he was unable to afford the tuition. So we can show that he instead attended a lesser known school with the help of scholarships and financial assistance. Jesus Christ, there's so much on him. After graduating with high honors, Isaac enlisted, uh, m enlisted in the Merchant Marine. He quickly gained reputation for his resourceful engineering solutions. For two years, he was promoted to a higher profile position closer to the major shipping lanes. Isaac's career at this point, this would coincide with psychiatric reports that his mother's mental health was deteriorating and bank records show payments to a psychiatric facility for treatment. This seems to be where Isaac met um, a medical officer and neuropsychiatrist called Nicole Brennan and her name appears on Octavia's physician roster. The two of them ended up cohabitating until Brennan accepted a promotion and have to serve the Ishimura. 
Oh god, I'm almost done. <laughs> uh, Pal's return from his extended tour coincided with Octavia's release from the hospital. Whatever his assignment was, Pal's service records remain mysteriously classified by executive order, and unless he can find fine and Isaac he took his secrets to the grave the next records we have are death notices for both Powell and Octavia their bodies were willed to the custody of the Church of Unitology along with the Clark's entire state apparently on Octavia's wishes Isaac re Isaac's repeated petitions to have his parents bodies turned seem to have been ignored since the church refuses any inquiries related to its members the cause of death are unknown overall Isaac's are more than qualified to handle a job like the Ishimura I talk politics over religion though. Kenja Daniels. I couldn't find anything on her in the time you gave me, but Dalton swears by her. Apparently, she's on a mission with his recommendation. If he thinks she has what it takes, who might argue? That was a lot of reading. Now, where are you You're here? You Hello. You? Is that good? Haley, I need you to listen. The Ishimura's overrun with the fucking monsters. You didn't hear anything? What? No, the comms are still out. Isaac. We need the Killian fixed now. Got a damage report? Uh, yeah, it, it's there. Run diagnostics. Okay. Did I get a thing? I really should get rid of some of the shit. Go. Jesus. What's happening? Oh. systems are locked down with the captain's codes. So we find Captain Matthias. Track his rig. Okay. Thing over there, okay, here. Okay, here. Captain Benjamin Matthias. Location medical. Status deceased? Even the captain? Locked. God. Isaac, you're closer to medical. You can double back and cut through maintenance. Find the captain's body and get his rig. With his codes, we... What was that? Chen? Shit. Get to the medical deck. God damn. That shit's kicking off. I'm gonna do a save point. And that'll do for this time. I think an hour ish is a good stopping point for this. I quite like it. It's quite nice. I get to. It's good to see that I have to melee more than use my gun, which is cool. 
and the status thinging with the Y is awesome. Uh, <laughs> the only thing I don't like is that we walked around like a rhinoceros. <laughs> but yet, yeah. I, I said a long ep, not extra long. Well, this is long compared to you because um, I was only able to get squeezed in like 40 minutes with the time slot earlier, so this counts as long. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to end it here. I've had enough of killing things with my feet and my punchy punchies right now. So, we'll go look at his body. I'm going to alternate day and day, so it'll be the day after tomorrow. So... Look forward to it. Then I'm also going to have to use a bland picture with numbers on it as well because there's no proper cinematic cutscenes here. So, yay!